guys. Welcome back. Phantom Nightmare Championships. Round to two. We got Vanquish Souls versus Memento. A set that debuted in the Valiant Smashers set that came out last November? Yeah. Really want to play uh, Centurion, by the way, from that, but I really don't want to pay $200 for the core. Especially since I uh, I ended up buying a Promethean Princess. By the way, Shifter set and Shifter first turn. And... He's got a Destroyer card in his hand. And he was special. That's the new support, by the way, for the Mementos. But yeah, I, uh, I ended up spending money on Promethean Princess. And then I ended up... Uh, Buying a box like a dummy after I said, I'm only going to buy singles. Pulled another one. So now I got two. And I ended up getting a uh, shiny, what's it called? QCR. Meowmanade. So uh, it actually kind of worked out. Alright, effect. It's going to special and then it will banish the search. I'm not all that familiar with Mementos. I know they're not a very big competitive deck, and they're actually based off... I like their lore a lot. They're based off of the uh, monsters, like the really old-school monsters. Like that Karibo-looking thing, for example, is a uh, Ghost from the Attic, like, remake. Retrain. Are right, you going to activate the field spell, the special? So it's going to discard a Mementos to target and destroy. All right, he's immediately going to chain it. Called by the grave, banishing the ghost from the attic. Memento. All right, it looks like uh, the field spell also had it banished. If he controls a level three or lower, he can destroy it and then special summon another level three or lower from the deck. Another based off of destroying each other. It's only a matter of time before Dino players get their hands on it. But I think the thing with the mementos is that they only destroy themselves, so. It's not a scrap uh, ra raptor. Or a scrap uh, wyvern thing where you just throw it in other decks, so. And you're gonna destroy. Again, that's kind of what they do, guys. They blow themselves up for effect. Like, all those monsters that he blew up, he could have just gotten a. a probably got, could have gotten, like, a good boss monster out, but. Not every deck is equal, unfortunately. It is what it is. So now that I think about it, I don't think he was activating any effects in Grave. He couldn't. And he's going to go to battle, swing. All right. All right, Vanquish Souls. All right, Pot of Prosperity. Add the rise in. All right, he's checking columns, rise in effect. All right, I get the feeling, I get the strange feeling that uh, Vanquish Soul is about to pop off. Put a 
back to hand the special. We have fire and earth to burn 15. QCR Flex. QCR Flex, baby. Alright. Gonna bounce to summon the Caesar. Alright, let's move for I think it's 35. 3,000. Alright, he's gonna pass. Alright, it's looking a little rough for Mentos here. Alright, stand by, activate the effective order. To reveal the draw. Back to add the special. Alright, game two, guys. Yeah, that sounds about right. Sand was interesting, though. There can only be one, which I know is a memento staple and a harpy duster. All right. All right. Vanquish Souls versus Mementos. Let's go. Pot of Extravagance. Banish six to draw two. And then roll and lock burn. Gotta love it. You see, this is why I'm, this is why I side deck cross out designator in that card because this it's like you always see it, and you always see it at the worst time too. Literally, just shut down mementos. Like, look at that. Just gotta love it. Talk about that shotgun. Prosperity for six to reveal six. Which is better, guys? Extravagance and Prosperity. I guess it depends on the deck, don't it? Alright, it, it got ashed. So, Fenrir. Not the fear, Fenrir is here. Your ash. Peh. Should have had a droll. Ulti, by the way, more flex. Search. All right, that's their monster of horn. Battle, attack the Fenrir, and attack the Rock. Well, actually, no, I don't think the Rock has any attack points. Never mind. Set and draw, and set and passes. Alright, Mementos can finally have a turn. Again, that's like how, it's like, other than blowing themselves up, that's all they do is search. You know, I really should not be ripping on this deck, but at least Heroes had something to it. But then again, they've had years of uh, fan idolization and support, so, uh, you know, Konami official supports, so, you know. It is what it is. We got the special. It'll add. By the way, I see them uh, nice sleeves too. OCG sleeves. All right, the zebra card, the horse, stride to, to set. 
I think it is. He may have a response. <laughs> Alright, send that to grave. Definitely know that's one of the more bigger plays is using that horse to send them all to the grave. Alright, yeah, it sends them to the grave. It was special summon a level 2 lower mementos from grave. Destroy itself to add. And I think it's to get the boss monster out because you want all the cards in the grave so you can summon the boss. Or... Yeah, it looks like you banish all the cards from the grave to get the boss card out. I did play this, I did play his deck once. I just don't remember what they did exactly. I know he summoned this card though. Vessel summons it. It's gonna set. You're gonna get attack all monsters as opponent control one to each. Goblin effect in hand. So it cannot be targeted by er, it cannot be targeted by card effects? Alright, he's gonna reveal the fire to change the attack position of the monster. Alright. So that trap will force him to attack the monster with the highest. Against monster effects, that's fascinating. Okay. It's gonna chain two fires to search in response to the flip. They might be getting a ruling on this one. I know there's one of these rounds where they had to get a ruling, so this might be it. Should I do a tactical difficulties cut? I mean, I didn't the last time. Yu-Gi-Oh for you guys. Something tells me I'm going to cut this out. So, uh... Yeah. So yeah, he's getting the search. All right, adding Caesar.
Oh, Memphis. All right, it looks like he has to attack that card. And that other card is negating everything. Or monster effects. All right, he's going to special from grave or hand. All right, he's going to chain Fenrir to negate to to banish it. So, then he'll negate it. He'll negate Fenrir to protect the trap. All right, normal summon. Checking that extra. Alright. Ah, uh, was wondering when we were gonna start seeing SP Little Knights. She's alive, guys. SP to target the monster, the boss. And uh, then he will take control of it by chaining the effect of that card. Sheesh. Alright, Vanquish Souls continuing. Special. Oh, I'm sorry, add. Mm. Alright, Memento's catching up. Oh, never mind. Four over two K. All right, he's going to target and destroy it. Looks like time is almost up too, guys. So this might actually be the last round. Alright, he got his little knight back. Destroy for cost. He might be chaining. Rock. He's going to chain rock to special from hand. All right, send the zebra again. The horse. Welcome back, King of Mementos. Alright, I guess it resurrects itself by shuffling them back. I'm gonna activate the effect chain. Bank of Soul will chain. So, flip that into defense. It's chain week two. Mace. Mace. Did 
this card to take control of Caesar and then Caesar chain reveal and then it will be unaffected by the other opponent's card effect. Alright. I IP chain targeted banish or SP. Gotta love SP a little night. Two hundred dollars by the way, guys, for that card. Just about. Insane. Alright, it's good to see the Mementos player catching up at least. At least he's going to he's at least he's able to play this game. Alright, he's gonna add from deck to hand or Alright. They both come back. Alright. Can Vanquishels take this turn and take this round? Alright, reveal two fires to add. Gotta get the rise in. Alright, main phase. Reveal Dark Fire Earth. Alright, Mace to attempt to steal again. Chain SP Little Knight. Wait, can you do that? Damn, I think you could do that. Yeah, I think it's just two cards, right? Can you do that? All right, oh, he's going for the search. I'm going to look up and see if you can even do that. All right, he's going to go main phase two. Yes, you can. All right, fair. All right, yeah. That cheekiness pretty much just won him the game more or less. All right. All right, Balin was a good sport for this. He was the one playing the Mementos deck, by the way. Shout out. Hey, how's everybody doing? I'd like to thank everybody who made it this far into the video. I just have one little quick thing I'd like to put at the end here. I am trying to save up funds for a trip to YCS North Carolina Rally. So if you are already going to look for singles on TCG players, consider browsing my storefront. That's all I had to say to you guys. Thank you very much, and I hope you enjoyed the video.